Hi, this is your scan laptop X. It has two laser projectors. One is the seven line laser and another one is 34 line laser. I have already tested the seven line laser in many of my uh, previous video. It can capture black color uh, very well in many shades of black, no issue at all. Uh, but I haven't tested the 34 line laser. So in this video, I will try to fail uh, this scanner by scanning in a very a black shade to see what kind of um, black surface condition that it cannot capture okay let's find out okay I will scan this part of the car which is black color let's try if 34 lines blue laser can scan this use magnetic markers 0.5 I can scan black color I can feel that it's slower than scanning a white car. Okay, the next object will be this uh, motorcycle seat. It's a matte black color. Try if the 34 lines blue laser can scan this. So I use the sticker marker because it's soft. I use sticker. It's soft material. So you can remove it very easy. If I want to remove this, I need to take off this and this and this so it take a long time so we just scan over while the seat is still attached to the motorcycle. So it's important that the scanner can scan the black object without splaying because if it cannot then it's not worth the price.
Okay, we need to do it quick before the sun is rising. The black seat is okay for scanning. Okay, let's take a look at the scanning result in Blender. This is the direct import from CRScan software. There is no post-processing, no retouch, no smoothing. Take a look for yourself. You can see that the 34 lines uh, leave uh, a lot of uh, striking lines when I scan with a black color. Uh, because last time when I scanned a white car panel, doesn't leave the striking line this much. And the uh, marker removal is good. I can see that it removes all of the marker automatically. Okay, let's take a look at the motorcycle seat. Look at the details of the stitching line. It's very pronounced. Look here on the side. All the bump and high is also show up. This is also not post process. Direct import from the CR scan software. I just add the material and turn on the ray tracing. Okay, next object will be this uh, metallic black color. See if the Lapta X 34 line bulleter can scan this. It's a bit of a refractive and dark color. Can pick up the metallic gray dark color but it's not as fast as the matte black color so the metallic gray is take longer time to scan Okay, let's try this uh, black mouse. Okay, I use 34 lines. See, it's 34 lines. It's captured slowly. So here, see here? It's still uh, in an orange color. Now I'm going to use seven lines. So see here? It's much faster with seven lines blue laser. It's turn a green quicker than the 34 lines. So if you are going to scan small object, uh, try the seven lines will be better, faster. Here's the other. I try to scan this uh, black gunmetal color. Okay, first I try with the cross line. There is no laser lines on the object at all. Probably you can see it. So I need to adjust the brightness manually even with the maximum brightness the laser line doesn't show on the top of this uh, gunmetal color okay let's try if it can scan in automatic mode yeah it can scan but it's very slow it's still in a red color very difficult to pick up It's 0 0.3 mm resolution, still can't pick up, it's taking a really long time to capture.
there are certain angle when I uh, move the scanner if it shows the laser line see here is not nothing is captured but if I move it like almost uh, 90 degrees to the floor it will capture okay let's try with the seven line Uh, seven line capture faster and not as fast as the, the other with the NIR but it's much better than 34 lines so the seven lines can capture black color much faster than the 34 lines so clean now the laptop X with the 34 lines blue laser can scan uh, all of the black color that I try in this testing today uh, but it scans slower than the parallel line the seven line blue laser if you need to scan the small object switch to seven line it will give you a faster result and also if you have a black color object I mean if it's small enough then try with the seven lines will give you a better result here's the announcement from the Creality they asked me to tell you guys that if you own Creality scanner and they want to uh, improve their products so they will offer you some price in exchange for filling the feedback form so if you want the scanner to be improved in a certain way you can fill the form I put the link in the description anyway I do not work for Creality I do this uh, video and the previous video out of my free time it's not sponsored okay thanks you guys uh, for watching. I'll see you in the next video.